Welcome back, everyone. Um, this is part 16 of my playthrough of Pokemon Brown Buzzlot. Last time, uh, we caught a Voltorb uh, from a Static Encounter and a Flappy, uh, both of those from the Power Plant. Uh, we encountered a Raikou, and unfortunately it used Roar, and then disappeared, so no Raikou. Uh, we also caught a Tangela. Uh, we found a gym in the middle of nowhere that apparently has normal Pokemon. Uh, we failed to catch a tentacle, because a tackle destroyed it. And then we made it to Igulo City. Uh, this, and we haven't done anything in between, uh, so it's just been picking up exactly where we left off in the last episode. Uh, and this time what we're gonna do is we're gonna take out some of these, uh, trainers on this route that we kind of ignored the first time around. Uh, go from there and then probably go take on that gym. Oh, last time we also failed to catch a Magmar in the thing that's very similar to the Safari Zone. We are not gonna stay fighting you there, buddy. Oh, yeah, it was a good thing we changed Pokemon there. Even that, that did, that did more than half of Rue's health. Ugh. This is, this is gonna be rough. In. Of course it's gonna confuse me, but I was gonna get confused anyway. This is uh, probably like more of an ocean, not a not a tub. Uh, just just so you know, there, baby. Another one. You gone? Man, these Pokemon are just above my levels. All right, let's send in Cartman. That didn't do much damage. How much damage will Dragon Pitch do? Not much damage either. See, like, that's that's what I mean by Dragon Rage. At this point, Bite's doing almost the same amount of damage. Stop growling at me. It's weird for my dugong to be growling. Zunisha Group 41. He's trying to learn Screech. I don't think we're going to learn Screech. Yeah, we're not learning Screech. Azumarill. Let's Giga Drain it. Rock attack. That's a rock attack too. I think. Or no, that might just be a normal attack. Doesn't matter, I just stole its health. 
for Alligator. We're gonna keep out Raditz. Raditz is the best bet here. Oh, that's not good. Okay. I was gonna say, because that did me more than half damage, so if he had slashed me again... Can I fly from the water? What do you say here? Great, I lost. I mean, yeah. Apparently I can fly from the water. I don't even talk to these trainer or these uh, people in the Pokemon Center. No, 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 didn't want to talk to you again. I did talk to these people. Yeah, I think I did talk to these people. Anyway. Yeah, unfortunately I uh, could not catch Pokemon in that park. <clears throat> Let's surf on Rue today. So we hit you. We hit you. Let's just go straight down. Oh, look, there is another trainer here. Also, a tentacle. There's a lot of tentacles here. Can't swim yourself, Wimp. Oh, well, that's pretty nice of you. Oh, that's one of those, like, stuck up junior trainers. Just mega punch this thing, see if it helps. A couple more mega punches. Water gun, hopefully that doesn't do too much damage. Hey, critical hit, awesome. A seeking. I don't want to leave Rue out being damaged like that, so we'll send out uh, Gyarados. Uh, Cartman here. I need to flinch a little bit more there, Seeking. Use some of these. Lemonade. Oh, 39, 2. 119, that's 80. Lemonade heals 80 health. That's a lot of health to heal. So, Lemonade is definitely worth the uh, coinage you spend on it. For the amount it heals you. Because I think it was only like 300 or something. Okay, there's that dude on that platform. I will win. Hop, hop, hop. It's a swimmer with one Pokemon, and it's a Starmie. It's only level 44, though. Let's try Mega Punch and see how that works. Oh, that did good damage. Let's try Mega Punching it again. Just hopefully that water gun doesn't do 
too much damage. Okay, good, good. Grew, grew to 41. It's trying to learn Leer. Ah, oh, I don't want to learn Leer. Yes, abandon that. Only 220. Is he crying? Is he lost? He seems kind of pathetic. Hey man, you do you though. Another tentacle! A level 5 tentacle! Fishies. Okay. It's a beauty with one Pokemon. It's a Seeking! That's a level 46! Would you flinch, like, occasionally, please? <sighs> Dang it, it finally got me. I need, like, two more bites? Hey, Cartman's confused no more. Let's just tackle it this time. There we go. I like anime better. I like anime. One Piece is my anime of choice, but there are a lot of good animes out there. I'm on vacation, and you're swimming in the ocean. Now you're standing on the ocean. Oh, it's a junior trainer female. One of these weirdos. Uh, Vaporeon has a ton of hit points, if I recall correctly. Yes, it does. Wow. Just imagine a Vaporeon looking down, like a, like looking up at a Gyarados in front of it, and just wagging its tail at it. Obviously we'll have... Yeah, we're gonna get rid of Tackle, because we'll have Bite, and that's a Dark move. So we won't have a standard attack move, but I mean, we have Dragon Rage for now, but like I said, I think I'm gonna swap out... Uh... Oh yes, we are changing Pokemon. Shockwave wouldn't be a good thing, because it could know. Shockwave and Zunisha are bad decisions there. Throw on Sandman. Sandman could use some experience. Take a Psychic. Take another Psychic. Blam! Another Vaporeon, jeez. We'll keep in Sandman. It'd be cool if I got confused, but... Oh! I don't even want to mess around with this. Just don't flinch, please. Thank you. I 
after this fight, we should go heal up. Kinda see where everyone's at. No mercy at all, indeed. I know that's where Eagle of City is. Can I? Okay, this is gonna be interesting. There's a time and a place for everything. But it's not Oak's voice. That's sad. It's funny when Oak says there's a time and a place for everything. these guys. Well, we got 41s and we have 142, which is Raditz. Raditz is probably going to gain some more levels as we're going through this process because um, Raditz is our grass Pokemon and we're fighting water type tank trainers here. We did, luckily we did catch a backup uh, grass Pokemon last time. So we have that in our stockpile, so to speak. It's gonna bite you, whatever. Oh, where did we... We, did, we found out we needed 50 Pokémon for that XP share. Or, yeah, 50 Pokémon and a Pokédex for our XP share. What did we get up to last time? Because we know we caught a few after we found that out. I don't know why I'm fighting this. Oh, but luckily I got a critical hit there. Pokedex, we're at 35. So you have 15 more types. That might be possible. Okay, this is the last trainer I battled. Okay. Just go a little bit. There's a little bit of a jagged teeth edge there. Some of the water features. This guy's standing in the water. No? It looks like. Oh, now you're in the water. Hello, beauty. It's my sea drop. It would have been cool to catch a. Uh, uh, poor sea or Seedra and then be able to get a uh, Kingdra. Just faint, that's all I want. I'm getting pretty lucky, like this... Like, he... Okay, so he is lowering my accuracy out the wazoo, but I've been getting lucky with the hits, but also that he's not actually attacking me. Yes. We're just gonna send in Raditz for this because I just don't want to deal with the freaking hit points this thing has. I don't know where it went. Okay, so it's just sitting there increasing its defense. And I'm thrashing about and destroying it. Like, see, that's, that's what I mean. It could have been attacking me. Dugong. Try Ru. Oh, that's an ice move. Ooh, that did. 62 damage. Let's try another Mega Punch. Hmm. Don't crit. Ah. Neither of those two. Let's toss in Sandman. Hopefully Sandman can take a good hit here. 
And it growls. I could have left it. Brew. But better safe than sorry. I mean, it could have crit on that second one and I could have lost Brew. Another tentacle. I think I've only found tentacles. We're just gonna be in here and take you out with a water type move, even though you're a water Pokemon. Enjoy. Ah! The wild encounters, man! I just really don't care. Did I battle you? Darn. Oh, yes, I did. Okay. You're the one I just battled. Okay, so we haven't battled this dude, and I think this is the last one. Water is shallow here, okay. Ooh, he's got a lot a large defense, but maybe it would be best for this one. I don't know if he's got, got a lot of hit points. Yeah, so his hit points are kind of normal, but his defense is really high, so... Dragon Rage is probably actually a good move in this instance. I'm already confused. Now I'm not. Goodbye, Coaster. Lantern. Again, we're gonna go with... Go with Raditz. And lanterns seem. Like every lantern I've come across so far has used Confuse Ray, like, right off the bat. Raditz isn't very fast. And then it keeps using it. lucky with the confusion today. Okay. So, that's all the trainers there. Now we just have this mystery gem over here. I say mystery gem, it's not really a mystery. It's just, why the hell is it out in the middle of nowhere? We already beat this dude. It isn't normal when I lose. Well, maybe you should get used to it, buddy. I'm gonna put Zunisha up front. I'm gonna battle everyone. Because, like, why not? You get the experience from fighting these train. Oh, a Pidgeot! Well, we have a move for that. I'm gonna see if I'm faster. I'm probably not. Oh yeah, and I'm definitely not gonna be now. Oh, that did a good bit of damage. Let's see what that does to me. Oh, it didn't do much. Okay, so it, it's really fast, but it didn't do too much damage. It did 14 damage. Good Rio. We'll leave in uh, Zunisha. These have both been flying type, so I can't use Dig. And I'm wary about using my Rock Tip move. Like, I'd prefer to have, like, a move like Rock Throw or something over Rollout, because Rollout's a pretty powerful move. The problem with it is that I can't stop using it once I 
start using it, so like I can't stop to use like a potion or something. Persian. Yeah, because we can dig this Persian. Oh, I appreciate the coins in advance there, buddy. I appreciate the coins. And that doesn't give you much damage, so... Alright, Zunisha took out this entire trainer. Ah, 176. I mean, that's not nothing. Oh, let's try Shockwave. Let's put Shockwave up front. We probably will have to heal. Well, we're gonna have to heal, certainly, before we do the Gym Leader, but... Looks like the Gym Leader will be over there anyway. What? I am abnormal? I had an abnormal type. Unfortunately, it died. Hmm. Let's confuse it. Sound of that. Radic Radicates have a pretty good uh, attack value. Oof. Don't like crit or anything. Okay. Mm, switching out to somebody who's got some more health. Let's throw down Sandman. Oh! That was exactly half of my health. Um... Cartman it is! What if we start healing some Pokémon? No, and it's confused no more. That, that didn't do as much to Cartman. Let's just Hydro Pump it. Oh, come on, man. Okay, good. I hit with that. I'm probably gonna have to heal Cartman. I'll probably just leave Cartman in, depending on what he pulls out. Tauros. Ugh. We'll leave Cartman in, but we're gonna heal. Uh, where's my Hyper Potions? We'll use a Hyper Potion on Cartman. That was probably a good decision. Because he just did me 40... No, 38 damage. Hydro Pump it. Come clear. This gym leader might be tough, because he's going to be stronger than the trainers in here. Two, another Eradicate. We will leave in Cartman. Just Hydro Pump it again. Okay, good. That was a one-hit kill. Wigglytuff. Wigglytuff isn't normal. It's very... I'm calling some BS on this normal-type crap. That's a fairy type. Let's see what a Giga Drain does to it. Not much. Not much at all. Dang. The double slaps. Um. I guess Giga Drain is my best bet, really. It will heal back some of that damage it just did me. It's gonna defense curl. I, that shouldn't mess with Giga Drain. 
Don't put me to sleep. Should've used Battle Dance at that point. I'm just acid it now. Apparently acid was super effective against Perry, I, I guess. Um, poison is super effective against Perry. Um, we got pretty beat up by that one, and I don't want to just start burning potions left and right. So, I guess we're gonna... Go back to the Pokemon Center. Apparently we can dig just in the middle of a building. And then we'll head back and give it another go. But I have a bad feeling that this uh, gym leader is going to be like up to like level 30. Or up to like level 50 with his highest Pokemon. So I might want to do some training. Like maybe we'll take out all the trainers and then next time... Like, I'll train in between episodes, and then next time I'll go and, uh... Fight him. But we'll see as we get through these other trainers. We're already at 31 minutes, so... We're getting close to a point where, uh... would be a decent stopping place, I guess. Uh, what did we have? Level ups, we got 40. Yeah, Carpent leveled up, so... We have all 41s, a single 42, and a single 43. So that might be something I do, is between between this episode and the next episode, level everyone up to uh, 45 or something. But like I said, let's go battle the rest of these trainers here, and we'll go from there. I just have a bad feeling that if I go into the gym leader fight with my current Pokémon levels, uh, we're gonna lose one or two Pokémon. I mean, we have backups for almost every type we have here. We don't really have a backup for, um, Sandman, but we have that Ghastly, so, I mean, having a Ghost type over a Psychic type wouldn't necessarily be what I would prefer, um, but it's, we have a backup for a different type, at least. So, it wouldn't just be, like, a normal or another flying type. We have a backup grass, we have a backup water, uh, we don't have a backup ground, we got plenty of backup normal Pokémon. Alright, so we battled him last time. Alright. I love using normal Pokémon. Okay. It's a burglar with one Pokémon, and it's a Persian. Oh dear, it's a 48. Wow, and it... It's just gonna come off the bat swinging here. Let's see... Hit it apparently. Do <sighs> try one more time. Shockwave just died. So my flying Pokemon just got killed. See? That's what I mean. I'm gonna have to train things up in between episodes, because I, now I need a new flying Pokémon. We have backups, because we have that Spearow, and we have a, uh... Um... A Farfetch'd. We might have something else. We'll take, we'll take a look after this battle.
yeah, in, in fact, just after this fight, I think I'm gonna end the video. Um... We'll, we'll pull out a new Pokémon, put, uh... Put, uh, Shockwave into the Hall of the Dead. And if we had just been able to confuse him, any of those supersonics that hit, Shockwave might not have been dead. Okay, well, anyway. Uh, Zunisha, let's dig. We need a new flyer. That sucks. Alright, let's go put Shockwave into the hole that do I have fly on me? I know I have an HM. No, that's probably that's Surf. I knew it was gonna happen eventually. I think it was HMO2. Let's deposit. Okay, I wanna look. Where's the TMs? Okay, so I will be I will withdraw. I will withdraw that I can speak. Okay, I'm not gonna go to the um, casino right anytime soon. Oh, I just I didn't mean to deposit the good rod. That's okay. I'll, I'll re, re withdraw that. HMO3 goes in. Dragon scale goes in. Thunderstone, Electrolyzer, all those things can just go right in. Oh, Max Other, yes, because we'll want to save the Max Other for the Elite Four. What was TM25? Thunderbolt? Yeah, I can go in for now, because we don't have a electric Pokémon, and I'm not probably going to pull one out to replace Shockwave with it, because Shockwave was our flyer. Okay, so we got TM34, that's Bide, we don't need that. TM12 is Octazooka, don't need that. TM18 is Counter, don't need that. TM23... That's Dragon Breath. Okay, so we'll withdraw that. We will teach TM23 to Gyarados, uh, Carbon. Uh, TM45... It's Thunder Wave. We don't need that. HMO1... That was cut, I think. We don't need that. 39 is Swift. 13 is... Ice Beam. I'm just gonna kind of see if anyone can learn that. What was TM03? Three is Sword Stance, okay. Team 31 is Mimic. Team 24 is Thunderbolt, which we just... Did we have more than one of those? No, it was Thunder was the other one. We had Team 19, Seismic Toss. Team 42 is Dream Eater. HMO2 is what we were after. Okay. Um, someone's PC. Okay, so... Deposit. Shock. Oh, nope, nope, nope. We gotta change boxes to our Hall of the Dead. Alright, Hall of the Dead. Unfortunately getting a new person. So we have Jack, Worsby, Predator, Sasquatch, Darude, Donald, Bash, Quicksilver, and now Shockwave. It's sad, but it's a bummer to lo lose Shockwave, but like I said, Shockwave was really only fast. He didn't have too much, uh, yeah, didn't have too much, uh, like, attack or defense or anything. Okay, I don't need those guys. Ground Sloth. Oh, that's, uh, yeah, we don't need him. Pedra, maybe. Mothra. Could evolve it, but we already have a poison type, so I'm not really Spectre. What was Spectre? Oh, Spectre was a Ghastly. I don't think Ghastly can learn. Ah. Arachnia, no. Schrodinger, no. Parasite, Buzz, Red. So we got Reginald or Pedro. I think we're going to go Pedro. Just because Pedro's already level 27 and. 13 levels to get to 40, or 18 levels to get to 45 doesn't sound as bad as how long it would take the other Pokémon we have. 
Okay, so... Contain Dragon Breath. Cartman, yes, we're gonna replace Dragon Rage. Okay, so Cartman now knows Dragon Breath instead of Dragon Rage. So, Ice Beam. Let's just see. Cartman's able and Rue is able. Oh. I'm not sure. I don't want to teach it to Cartman because Cartman has, like, a physical attack bite, he has Dragon Breath, and then two Water type moves. And the only thing I would be able to replace in that instance probably would be Hydro Pump, so. And Rue. Uh, we'll, we'll hold off for now. We'll hold off for now on the, on the Ice Beam. But let's use Fly. Yes. Pedro is able. Same attack, Lear Fury, Attack, or Sword Stance. We'll get rid of Lear. Oh, it doesn't even know a flying move, so this is its only flying move. Okay. Deposit those things into my item bank. Alright, let's just heal everyone. Okay, so... You know, there's a cave here, so let's just go... Let's toss up Sandman. Let's go see what's in this cave. So we could get into this cave. Maybe there's something new we can catch. And there is an encounter right away. Uh, we can't catch Psyduck. Wow, it's level 9? Were we already in this cave? You know what? We might have been. Okay, I don't think we can catch anything here. Yeah, we can't. This is the cave we originally came in. Uh, where we got Psyduck the first... No, we didn't get Psyduck the first time. I think this is the cave where we caught, uh... Sandman. I just see if Drowsy spawns here, but I think it's the same cave. I can't... I don't really have a... This is, like, the other, the other entrance. So, okay, well, I guess we can't catch anything here, plus if we do it, even, even then it's a really low level. Yep, this is where we caught Sandman. Man, all the way back to level 9. Look at you now, Sandman. Where does this go? this? What are we? A ditto? I don't know if this technically counts as the cave anymore. I don't think having a ditto would even be very useful. But it is a much higher level. But I'm gonna say it does- it still counts as the cave. I'm just confused as to where we are right now. That's... this is confusing. Hollywag? Now all these are like level 25, so this is like a higher leveled area, but I think it would still count as part of the cave, I would assume. Where is this place going? It's just a long tunnel. There's beds here? What 
This might be where I need to go to get whatever... exploring this cave thing, but realistically. Okay, so where is this thing gonna go? to the man. The man put it in his pocket. Thank you so much, kid. Um, no problem. Now, what's that reward? Oh, yeah, an HM that can push boulders around. Oh! Okay, we just got strength! Okay, let's teach strength. I bet you Rue can learn it. Let's see who else can, though. Rue can learn it. Zunisha can learn it. Cartman can learn it. Cartman. Cartman. Okay, let's teach it to Rue. Because that's what my plan was anyway, to teach it to Rue. Um. Hmm. Well, I mean, we could get rid of Comet Punch. Comet Punch tends to miss pretty frequently. Plus, we have Mega Punch, which I think ends up doing more damage. So we'll get rid of Comet Punch. Okay, so Rue learned strength. Awesome! Let's push this thing out of the way. Oh, we found a mist stone! I think that lets us into that gym in that town. Okay, let's fly back to the city we were in. Okay, so I just want to test something real quick. I think that lets us go into this other cave. Yeah, we got strength. Okay, yeah, it does. So, next time... Well, before next time, I'm going to train up to everyone to level 45. Because I don't want to lose any more Pokemon here. Um, if possible, I probably still will lose something. Because I'm guessing that gym in that other town, or that gym in the middle of nowhere that we were fighting in, the normal one. I bet you the gym leader's Pokemon are going to cap out at 50, but if we're at 45, with everyone, we should be able to take it. Um, Pedro's going to be fun leveling up. Um... But yeah, so we will train everybody up in between episodes. And yeah, okay, well, thank you for watching, everyone. I uh, hope y'all enjoyed it. I uh, hope everyone has a wonderful day. See you next time.